subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Title, Running Command Line Commands in Python, a step-by-step -step tutorial. Introduction Executing command line commands from within a Python script can be useful in various scenarios, such as automating tasks, interacting with system utilities, or integrating external tools. This tutorial will guide you through the process of running command line commands in Python, providing code examples along the way. Using the subprocess module Python subprocess module is a powerful tool for interacting with the system command line. It provides a convenient way to spawn new processes, connect to their input slash output slash error pipes, and obtain their return codes. This example runs the lsl command and captures its output. The capture underscore output equals true argument captures the standard output, and text equals true ensures that the output is decoded into a string. Handling command line arguments. You can pass command line arguments dynamically by using Python variables. This is useful when you need to create commands based on user input or other dynamic factors. In this example, the file underscore path variable is used to dynamically generate the command. Redirecting input and output. The subprocess module allows you to redirect input and output streams. This is useful when dealing with commands that require input or when you want to save the output to a file. Here, the input argument is used to provide input to the grep command. Handling errors. The subprocess module also enables you to capture and handle errors that may occur during command execution. The check equals true argument raises a called process error if the command returns a non-zero exit code, allowing you to handle errors gracefully. Advanced options. The subprocess module provides additional options, such as running commands in the background, subprocess.popen, setting environment variables, and more. Check the official documentation for more details. This example uses subprocess.popen to run the sleep command in the background. Conclusion Running command line commands in Python using the subprocess module is a versatile and powerful way to interact with the system. This tutorial covered the basics of executing commands, handling arguments, redirecting input and output, handling errors, and introduced advanced options. Experiment with different commands and adapt the examples to your specific use case. ChatGPT